Hello everyone, my name is Dave Yu. I am uh, here at Underground Elephant. I had a great opportunity to uh, talk to all the people here about mindset, about applying yourself in a positive manner and getting things done. I think that's really, really important. I was wondering if you could relate the warrior mentality to say a salesperson here no, at well, Underground Elephant. Well, the warrior mentality is very interesting. Everybody sees the warrior mentality as combative. You're fighting and you know you see the, you know, the, the opponent, you must you know, take care of the opponent. Well, the warrior mentality is, is what you're doing every day. You know, my wife's got a warrior mentality because she's got three little kids, man. If not, she's going to be dominated. The warrior mentality is where is your mind and how are you going to succeed and how are you going to win? And I always say this, the warrior mentality is a three component that I use. It's called the three A's. Everybody heard the term the three A's? It was used for combatants, but I realized it can be applied in many, many ways. So I want you guys to follow along with me without poking your eyes or hitting your head. So do this with your finger right here. Just go along with me, and I want you to read aloud. Say aware. Aware. Real loud. Not like aware. <laughs> aware. Put it right your head. Assess. 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 Assess what's going on at all times and take action. Act. Act. So once you make the assessment, you have to take action. If the first day of being aware and assess and make no action, then you are absolutely if you're aware of something that's going on, you're making an assessment constantly, you take immediate course of action, it's a warrior type of mentality. You're constantly doing something, you're moving forward at all times. And I tell this to everyone, it doesn't matter if you're a police officer, or a soldier, or you're at home working with your kids, be aware of uh, what's going on and then dominate that situation in a positive way. And I call this thing compose and impose. You think about it, when you're imposing on somebody, it sounds very aggressive, but you can use that in a positive term. Whatever you do, whatever you deal with, keep and maintain your composure. I need to go to the next step, I need to go to the next step. I'm not worried about the next step, I'm worried about the present and seeing how successful I can be, how I can mentor and guide people. And when you do that naturally and sincerely, it'll happen automatically. People will see that and they'll resonate and you'll resonate that feeling and people will gravitate towards you. And you'll wake up one day and you're like, wow, how did I end up here? I didn't even work hard. Well, you did work hard natural self and you're a natural leader. 